Okay, I don't, I don't know. Hi, my name is Chris. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Welcome, welcome. For those of you that don't know, I live in my car, my SUV, full time, and I work out of my car full time, doing gig work, Instacart, DoorDash, Uber, skip the dishes. Although I don't really do food deliveries anymore, I mainly just stick to Instacart. Instacart is busy enough in my uh, market. And the payouts are pretty good that um, I can make it work. Once in a blue moon, I throw on the other apps. But, not, not lately. Anyway, I'm sitting outside McDonald's. So first thing in the morning, I like to come to McDonald's to use the restroom because they have an accessibility bathroom. It's fairly large. So I like to go in there and get my privacy, and then I brush my teeth and put on deodorant, use my baby wipes and all that fun stuff. And uh, why is that guy waving at me? Hi. I mean, hi. <laughs> okay, friendly bench here in Canada. <laughs> There's no one else around. Whatever. Any hoodles. I um, I walked in there and. I said, may I have the key to the bathroom, please? She says, oh, they're, they're open down the hall. And I said, no, I'd like the key to the accessibility bathroom. And she's like, well, mm, we're not really allowed to. And I said, well, you know, before you finish, let me just politely interrupt you here. Um, you're not allowed to ask about why I need the accessibility bathroom. I said, that is actually against the law. So, uh, may I just please have the key? And she kind of just looked at me. And she ended up giving me the key. But, I mean, I for those of you that don't know, I worked in customer service, uh, specifically retail management, for decades. So, I know all the laws. I know the rules of the game. And they are not allowed to ask. They are not allowed to assume. Well, I mean, they can assume all they want in their own head. They're just not allowed to assume verbally whether or whether not or why or why not you need the bathroom or the the key to the accessibility bathroom so she ended up giving it to me and then I went in there and I did my business which was a huge mistake to brush my teeth before I finished my coffee because I came back out to my car and took a sip of my coffee it's like whoa minty coffee yeah. I guess I mean people do do like a peppermint mocha I guess oh my stomach is growling holy Hannah banana um, I guess that is a thing but not when it's like a not expected and B no for me I'm not a big I'm a coffee let me rephrase that I'm not a coffee connoisseur no I'm a Timmy's sweet and creamy no flavors no whipped cream no fancy pantsy None of that stuff. Just give me my coffee. Anyway, I need a muffin. I am so hungry. I don't think... Oh. Okay. I got two muffins. Oh, hi. I got two muffins left. Don't let me forget that I need to buy some muffins tomorrow. The Muffin Man! Anyway, I uh, get a six pack and I individually bag them so I don't leave them exposed. But... We are in the rainy season. For those of you that don't know, I am on the west coast of, oh, 
we have now entered the rainy season west coast for those of you that don't know i am in the west coast of canada pretty much as far west as you could go if i go another five uh kilometers three and a half miles for you people in the united states um, yeah, I will literally be in the Pacific Ocean. I'm on an island, actually, so there's water all around me, and we have hit the rainy season. We have hit it. It'll probably rain from now until, mm, I don't know, maybe next May. Yeah, that's how it works here. It's just going to rain and rain and rain. Well, that's typically how it works. Everything's a little off these days. Everything's a little weird. So, I don't know. According to the weather, like, I just see non-stop rain, which is going to be a challenge trying to keep the inside of my vehicle very dry and whatnot, especially when I'm doing, you know, deliveries, the wet bags coming in. I don't know. I don't know how this is going to work. We're experiencing this all together. That's what we do. Anyway, my plan of attack today is to work, obviously, because I need to make some money. Oh, here comes Buddy that was waving at me. Did you, uh, he's a food delivery guy. Oh, maybe he just recognized me from doing food delivery. I don't know. I've never seen him before. Maybe he just recognizes me because I'm YouTube famous. Not. Um, any hoodles. I'm going to work today. I'm going to eat my muffin because I'm so starving. And... I'm just going to go and see how the day goes and whatnot. Halloween decorations are coming out. Oh my gosh, you guys. Some of them are so good. So I want to, whenever I uh, run by a house. <laughs> okay. I'm not running by the house. Like, like, let's be real. Let's just be real here. When I drive by a house, if I'm not in too much of a hurry, I'm going to try to stop and get it filmed because some of these houses these people have done so good and I know it's not dark but it's overcast so you'll get the same kind of concept I'm not sure these muffins I found are so good I find them in the superstore and they're called morning glory I know I'm, I'm fully aware anyway they are like kind of a combination between like a carrot cake and it's got like coconut and raisins like it's quite lovely I quite enjoy them so I'm gonna go eat my muffin drink my coffee hopefully get an instacart and that's just how my morning is going okay <laughs> Oh, look, the sun is coming out. It's trying to. It's trying to. Here's hoping. Okay, so I was just kind of sitting here chilling. Um, I left my sweater at my friend's place last night, so her hubby just came and dropped it off because he had to go shopping, and I was just, I was really not feeling, I don't feel sick, but I just don't feel, you know, I'm just whatever. Anyway, I had Instacart on, and all of a sudden, like, this $102 Instacart from Costco showed up, picking up seven items, and I'm like, what? Well, one of them is a computer, a Mac, an iMac, or MacBook, or whatever the heck you call them, and uh, so I'm like, all right, I'll go shopping for seven items for $102. That just, that's going to make my goal for the whole day. Um, I'm driving across town, I think maybe about 18 kilometers, but all right, I'm okay for that. So I guess what I have to do is go buy the other stuff first, come back and get the ticket because they keep them locked up, but I'm going to go do that and make a hundred bucks and I'm not going to run over this pedestrian. Go ahead. Yep. Yeah, thanks. Rain stopped. The sun is trying to come out. So that's good news. And my seat warmers on and my butt's getting hot so anyway yeah I'm gonna go uh, shopping and then maybe if I could get one more and kind of like really really go over my goal 
then maybe we can do something special for dinner tonight. I don't know. It's still, it's not even like 11 o'clock in the morning. So you know what? That's the thing about living this kind of lifestyle is there's like, you don't sleep in much. Well, much at all. What's happening here? They're going to go. And then I'm going to go and I'm going to go make $100. And hopefully I'm going to pray that I don't go get tip baited because the tip was like 80 bucks. So anyway, onwards we go to Costco. Okay, laptop is dropped off. And you know, the one thing about Victoria, you have to dress in layers because we wake up, it's five degrees. Now it's 16, two hours later. Whew! So, we dress in layers, multiple layers. Anyway, had to get that off. That was stinking hot and the rain stopped and the sun is coming out. Um. I may or may not be able to continue working this afternoon. So I'm glad this uh, Instacart order came through. The uh, machines at Costco are not working. They're super old. So with a purchase as big as the laptop, I had to use the physical card. And it wouldn't work, wouldn't work, wouldn't work. Um, the machine just was not reading the chip. No, I, I'm just already here. We're gonna navigate to the new place. Thank you. Oh, it's 25 minutes away. Okay, we're going for a little bit of a jaunt. That's okay. Anyway, the chip reader would not work because their machines are so old. So I had to use the digital card, but the tap, you can only tap 400 at a time. So we had to 150 meters. Google. Right onto Phyllis Drive. We had to tap 400, 400, 400. I think it was like a $1,300 item or something. Any hoodles. Take the Be next ride onto Phyllis listen, Drive. Listen, because there was so much activity on my tab, I got an email saying, um, your account has now uh, been suspe suspended due to suspicious activity. In 400 meters, turn left onto Watkins Way. You will not be able to work until whatever they investigate. So hopefully they can see why I did what I did. I have the receipt. I have everything in case I have to dispute it or something. But what a pain in the booty. Wow, is it warm. Anyway, we're off to the other side of the world. dropped off at an oceanfront property. I figure I'd share some of the view. Oh, what is that coming in? Okay, those two that Instacart order is complete. Oh my gosh, I can't even imagine. I wonder if I, oh, it's a four hour limit parking down here. I was like, man, I should come spend the night down here. Any hoodles, I'm in an area called Cadova Bay. A lot of old money here. A lot of old money. There's a lot of newcomers to Victoria. A lot of new, um, 
people, but there's, there's still a lot of old money here. A lot of old money, and I was happy to do that Instacart order for $102 and change. Just an F, whoa, hi, you're all crooked, huh? <laughs> Just an FYI, Instacart already emailed me saying that they checked out my account, everything was good to go, and I am able to continue work. Dang, 186 a liter. I haven't seen it that low. I don't even know, like, in a million years. I put in $60. That almost gave me a full tank of gas. <laughs> I haven't seen that in a long time. Anyway, um, is it too early for another coffee? What time is it? Oh, yes. I gotta wait about at least another two hours. I mean, I don't have to, but I'm trying to pace myself. I'm going to hang out and hopefully get another really good Instacart order. Wouldn't that be amazing? Could we do two amazing Instacarts in one day? Never know. Okay, well, the sun didn't last long. And now they're calling for uh, thunderstorms probably. So we're, we're kind of going through all the weather. Woo! We're, go we're going through it all today. The wind began to switch. The house to pitch and suddenly the hinges started to a hitch okay this weather turns man like it like uh, two seconds we had beautiful sunshine sun, sunshine and now we're in a full-blown rainstorm again so you know what that means it means that my body will require a coffee because what better way to get through a rainstorm and possibly thunder than a nice warm coffee. And not only that, I have to use the restroom anyway, so I figure it'd be perfect time to drive over there, use the little restroom, the little ladies room, I don't know what that was, and um, get a coffee. Why is there so much traffic? I don't understand. Oh, right, because we're overpopulated. That's what it is. That's what it is. So, uh, Instacart, like, completely died down, but maybe now that it's going to be, like, full-on rainstorm, we can get a couple more orders before the evening comes. Now, my original plan was to grab something for dinner tonight, and go cook it down by the ocean but I may or may not be doing that because down by the ocean is about 10 degrees colder than up here now it's still pretty warm probably why the thunder because it's actually warm and it's raining and you know all that weather stuff happening but we'll see I don't want to go down there and freeze my butt off but I could go to a little park um, I haven't decided what I want yet. I don't know. I don't, I got another one of those little rice bowl things. No, quinoa bowls. I don't want to eat another one of those right now. I've been eating those so much. But we'll see. The day is still young. The day is still young. It's only 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Tim Hortons. That's where we go. Tim Hortons. Y'all need to sponsor me, man. I don't know what to tell you. to make its way out again. This weather really does not know what it wants to do today. It's still pretty windy, but the sun is shining and no more rain. I don't even know, man. Okay, so I'm a little surprised 
because I really thought with this weather that's happening, because it's like literally going back and forth every hour, it's raining again, still super windy, that Instacart would be a lot busier than it is. But it's not. I haven't seen anything pop up for a while. I mean, there's one sitting there, but it's really bad. Anyway, you know, the benefit, one of the benefits of living in your car, you always have your wardrobe ready because it's getting cold again. So now I need to layer again. And if this, whatchamacallit, the wind and stuff doesn't stop, I may have to bust out my actual jacket, which I don't want to do. It's really not waterproof. I really need to get a waterproof jacket if I'm going to be, you know, living this kind of lifestyle. Any hoodles, benefit. You get you, your whole wardrobe right in your freaking car. You get to change, layer, do whatever you need to do. Anyway, I've just been kind of chilling in the parking lot. I mean, really, that's, you know, what I do. And uh, I'm all crooked. The beanie's going to have to come on soon, or the toque, the toque, the toque. If it doesn't uh, slow down a bit. Oh, jeez. See, I'm all crooked. What, what is this? What is happening? Clearly, I don't know how to dress myself properly. But man, this is going to be an interesting night if this doesn't slow down. Sometimes the wind gusts get so bad that my whole car starts shaking. It might be a very interesting uh, night tonight when I go park and sleep for the night. But I don't know. I, I'm going to just hang out and see what happens. I mean, obviously I'm going to hang out. But it's not like I can go home. I am home. I'm in my tiny home. So I've just been kind of watching YouTube and I might throw on a Netflix movie. If I do watch Netflix though, I may bust over to Walmart because they have free Wi-Fi there. And then uh, maybe edit, get to some editing or something like that. I don't know. The day is still early. It's still early. So many things could happen. But if the wind remains like this, then I'm not going to try to bust out my stove and do any cooking. I'll just have to uh, figure something else out. I'm not going to try to... I don't have any wind uh, protectors for my stove yet. So we'll see. We'll see. All I know is I had to put on some warmer clothes because... We have gone through so many, we have gone through so much weather in like, what, a five hour period. Rain, sun, rain, sun, massive rain, now wind and rain. I don't know. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Do you see the sun? I know. Like, this is the weirdest day ever. Anyway. I am going to call it. Um, I didn't do any more than those two. Did I tell you I did two orders on Instacart? One for a hundred, one for thirty. I was going to take another one real quick, but someone snatched it up pretty good. Um, pretty good, <laughs> pretty fast. I mean, I'll leave the app on, but I'm going to go grab something to eat. I kind of feel like a nice big Caesar salad from somewhere and um, who knows what the night's going to bring. It's probably going to be back and forth again with the weather. Uh, but uh, thank you guys for hanging out with me today. I do appreciate it. I hope everybody's doing well and staying safe. Until next time.